we weren't sure where we were going to come back, but we're here. Four races, fourth race into the 2022 F1 season, and this is the We Missed the, we missed the Exit Imola Grand Prix preview. Go quick over the Australian Grand Prix results. Uh, Leclerc 1, Perez 2, Russell 3, Hamilton 4, Norris 5, Ricardo 6, Akon 7, Botas 8, Gasly 9, and Albon 10. First points for Williams from Albon. Uh, here is the race, the Australian Grand Prix race. Uh, obviously, this picture's a little off because um, there was more uh, different setup, but uh, let's just get keep going here. Uh, driver standing so far. Uh, Leclerc leading the pack, number one, 78 points. Uh, his teammate right behind him, Sainz, um, also in the Ferrari with 38. Russell with 37, Perez with 36, Verstappen with 33, uh, Lewis Hamilton does not have 92, uh, Norris with 20, Akan with also 20, Botas with 14, Magnussen with 13, Ricardo with 11, Gasly with 6, Sonoda with 4, Alonso with 2, uh, Guayo with, oops, uh, with 1. Uh, Albon also with one, Schumacher, Stroll, Vettel, and Latifi all have zero. Constructors Championship so far standings. Ferrari out in first with 116. Red Bull took second today with 69. Nice. Mercedes in third with 65. McLaren in fourth with 31. Alpine in fifth with 22. Alfa Romeo in sixth with 15. Haas in seventh with 13. Not bad for not having any points last year. Alpha Tori in 8th with 10. Williams in 9th with 1. And Aston Martin remains the only team with no points so far this season. Alright, the Imola Grand Prix track. Uh, one DRS zone. Uh, and uh, came in handy today during the sprint race. And if you got to watch it, good for you. Verstappen won the sprint race today. Don't know why everything keeps disappearing. Verstappen won the um, sprint again uh, after starting on pole, losing it right away to Leclerc, and you know came back at the last on the second to the last lap to uh, claim first place, get some points. Um, Verstappen I saw today has won every race he's finished so far this season. Let's see if he can keep that going tomorrow. A little bit of a preview there. Uh, again, Leclerc second, Perez ended up in third, Sainz moved his way up to fourth, he had a great race as well, uh, Norris ended up in fifth, Ricardo ended up in sixth, Botas in seventh, Magnussen in eighth, Alonso in ninth, and Schumacher in tenth, obviously there's no points for nine and ten, uh, but just like to give you the first ten drivers, um, because how they end the sprint race is how they're going to start tomorrow. So again, Verstappen is going to start P1. Player is going to start P2. Uh, here are my predictions for the race tomorrow. I think uh, Verstappen is going to win the race. Um, he did great during the sprint, uh, other than the start. And I really think he's on. He's really feeling it this weekend if his car holds up, which uh, hopefully it does. I think he's going to win the race. Uh, Leclerc is going to be second. Signs I think, gets around Perez for third. So that is your podium. Uh, Verstappen, Leclerc, Sainz. Uh, I think Perez is going to end up in fourth. Norris is fifth. Botas in sixth. Uh, Magnus is in seventh. Alonso in eighth. Ricardo ninth. And Schumacher getting his first ever F1 points tomorrow in tenth. Uh, the Haas car is looking good this year. I was not expecting it to be as nice as it is. Um, hopefully Aston Martin gets some points at some point. Uh, big fan of Vettel and I just uh, I don't think he's got it quite yet. It's only the second race of the season, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, so that is my predictions for the Imola Grand Prix tomorrow. Hopefully you enjoy it, and thanks for watching.